Welcome back. It's been 51 years since Ann Woodward was killed at the bar that she owned in Moab. Her killer was never found until today. Moab police say it's a cold case that has finally been solved thanks to a detective who decided to take another look at the evidence. New specialist Alex Cabrero tells us how it was done. For as much as Moab has changed in the past 10 years, Woody's Tavern is one of those longtime businesses that tries to keep things the same. Today, though, it just feels different. I don't know, it's just, it's just, it's just done, I guess, you know. Leslie Estes knows Woody's well. Her parents own the bar. It's also where her mother, Ann Woodward, was murdered, raped, and robbed in 1973 after closing. Her dad found her on the floor. It broke his heart, but it broke our family. Like, it, the splinter never was healed. It, it never really did even begin to heal. Maybe that healing can now begin. There's always justice that can be done. After 51 years, the Moab Police Department says they finally know who killed Woodward and presented their findings this morning, naming Doug Chudamelka as the killer. If Doug was still alive, he died in 2002, I would certainly ask for an arrest warrant to go to Fremont, Nebraska and arrest Doug for this crime. Moab Police Detective Jeremy Drexler took over the cold case two years ago. He found two boxes of evidence in a Grant County storage unit last year and brought those boxes to the Utah State Crime Lab. Using DNA testing procedures that weren't available at the time, evidence was found on Woodward's clothes, especially on the buttons of her shirt, as well as on a cigarette at the bar pointing to Chudamilka. Police saying he used her pants to strangle her. There is a, enough probable cause at this point to charge him with the, uh, the, the, the murder of Ann Woodward from March 2nd, 1973. It's the end of a case that has been unsolved for too long. I just wanted to say thanks to you. Yes. Thank this you. guy right here is so wonderful. And even though Estes knows it won't bring her mother back, she's thankful it puts to rest the longtime town rumors about her father. We now we know everyone, like I said, everyone knows that dad didn't do it. I just had a dear friend three months ago say that to me, that he thought Woody did it, and I was just flabbergasted. 51 years is a long time to hear those rumors, and Estes says she is happy she will never have to hear them again. The murder case of Ann Woodward is now solved. In Moab, Alex Cabrero, KSL 5 News. Amazing what that DNA technology does. Alex, thank you. Yeah.